we are seeing mounting frustration, tensions within school districts. Tensions over school mask mandates. We feel there's a need to provide some sort of light at the end of the tunnel to indicate that you know, the state does anticipate that it will be possible to, to end the mask requirements. That's why we've asked for, you know, the state to specify some indicators that would be used. Governor Kathy Hochul met with teachers, superintendents and parents on Tuesday. She asked for input on how to continue to protect students against COVID-19. The New York State Council of School Superintendents says it asked Governor Hochul to say what it would take to lift the mandate. It is set to end February 21st. The governor says it would be hard for the state to determine metrics right now. Their preference would be to wait and see what the facts are after winter break. From that, do you surmise that the mass mandate will be extended until the end of winter break? Yes, you know, that, that's the clear implication that, you know, if, if, if the intent is to wait and see what the facts are after the break, then it would, then that would uh, mean that the, uh, the mass requirement would be extended through that period. And I would think that if that's the case, the thinking is, Let's get through the recess. We know recess is our time when the, the infection rate seems to go up. Let's come back from the recess. Let's test, test, test. Let's make sure that the uh, virus rates are down, down, down. And then, uh, then maybe a more permanent decision can be made. What would you prefer to happen? To me, the sooner that we can make uh, masking a local decision, the better. So if it does become a local decision, and that falls on your shoulders, what would your choice be? We would strongly encourage uh, students and staff to wear masks. However, that was the, that would be the choice of the individual or the parents of the child. After I heard about the mask mandate's possible extension, I reached out to the governor's office. Her office pointed us to this press release where the governor said, quote, keeping schools open has always been my top priority. In the newsroom, Olivia Proya, 7 News.